Hi, I'm Sean Michael Reagan, and you're watching Cool Tools. For whatever reasons, I seem to be accumulating vacuum cleaners as I age. Here are four I dug out recently while reorganizing, none of which I actually use anymore. So I thought I might try repurposing them for dust collection in the shop. I've been thinking about putting in a central dust collection system down here for years, but it seems like there's always something more important and or more fun that I want to be doing with my shop time. And since I have all these small units lying around anyway, I thought, why not just dedicate one small vacuum cleaner to every stationary power tool rather than trying to plumb them all together to one big central vac? I tried it out first with my DW703 chop saw and this little J150A shop vac. You can see I've hung the vacuum from the ceiling so it doesn't take up space on the bench. And what I've been doing for about three months now is just plugging that in before I use the saw and unplugging it when I'm done. And that has been a vast improvement over not having any dust collection here at all. But it's obviously not ideal, A, because it slows you down, and B, because it doubles the number of power outlets you need to run the tool. This little extension box, however, solves both those problems. As you can see, it's got one plug and two outlets. You plug your tool into this one and your vacuum cleaner into this one, leave the vacuum cleaner power switch in the on position, and then the electronics in the box sense the current draw when you're using the power tool and automatically turn on the power to the secondary outlet. The auxiliary outlet has a built-in one second delay, so that your breaker doesn't get hit with a big starting current surge from both the vacuum cleaner and the power tool at the same time. It also has a 10 second run on time to clear the dust out of the vacuum line when you're done cutting. Besides a vacuum cleaner, you could also use this unit to control a work light, a power feed, a coolant pump, a fume extractor, or pretty much any other accessory appliance you might want to use with a power tool. At the time of production, this is about the most economical automatic switch unit you can get at 35 bucks, which, incidentally, is about the same number of seconds it takes to install. Okay, thank you for watching. As always, you'll find affiliate links down below the video. If you've seen anything here you like, please do check those out, as well as our blog and our podcast over at cool-tools.org. We'll see you next time.